hi and welcome back to this week's video so this week's video is going to include a card reading at the end we're at the Monsor Trail this time taking some time out you can see the bridge down there our bikes as well uh, we decided to take a bike ride in the Derbyshire Peak District it is so beautiful so Monsor Trail is an old train line and you can, as you can see it's all paved over and we were racing down there and there's an amazing amazing tunnel this tunnel is absolutely fantastic it's obviously an old railway line so an old railway tunnel great for the kids great for taking time out great for thinking space everyone and as you go through the tunnel you can scream and shout and ah, and just go through because it is absolutely wonderful I always say taking time out gives you that breather that you need to become more productive it enables you to spend more time with your family these are the things that I used to put off doing stuff like this with the kids going out places because I kind of felt that I would never get work done actually I actually get more work done more study time done especially if studying in a degree by coming and doing things like this. I'm going to end this with a card reading in a minute. But you can see the bridge now that we were on, that we were looking at. So this is the bridge that we're on. And we were looking down from up where those trees are onto the bridge. And then there's an amazing campsite that looks down below. So I hope you enjoyed this video. Stay tuned for the card reading just after. Hi, and um, so we've got a new setup. On Friday, we're gonna share a video of taking some time out, what to do during your time out, and also end that with card reading as well. So every third day, Thursday is gonna be like that. On a Tuesday, we're gonna either do mind and body work. So look forward to that. But this is a card reading just for you today. And I've chosen one card from the Lightseer's Tarot Pack. And the card today is the Nine of Swords in the upright. See this woman here? She really doesn't know what to do. Swords are all about your thoughts. Um, not like cups. Cups are more like for your emotions. Um, but about your thoughts. And you can see that she's got a lot of dark thoughts that are kind of risen above her so you might be going through some thoughts at this moment in time you don't know what to do you're feeling a bit of despair she's got a pillow next to her where she's got a bit of comfort comfort next to her but if you notice at the top of this card you can actually see the white bird come in she's got some good thoughts in there you need to work through those thoughts do you do any mindset work at this moment in time? Do you look after your thoughts? Think of some ways that you can look after your thoughts today. That is what's coming through from this card. Longevity is coming through as well. It seems like you're working on something and you need to be in it for the long haul. So just think about that. If this doesn't resonate with you, then move on. But if this resonates with you, I'm guessing like from a business point of view, possibly from a relationship point of view as well, maybe from a health perspective, there needs to be some longevity in something at this moment in time. And you need to be working through these thoughts. Remember thoughts, thoughts and narratives around thoughts sometimes get in our way and noticing the happier feeling thoughts that are arising to help us move forward. She's not noticing that she's got some great thoughts behind her and a pillow to comfort her. When you're going through rocky thoughts and you're working through them, turn to your basic needs of comfort and safety to reach your happier feeling thoughts. Have an amazing weekend and an amazing life. Speak soon.